Hey everybody, uh, Bobby Joe here for another, we're going to be doing another unbagging. I'm going to try and make um, some other additional videos today. So you're going to probably see me makeup less except for my eyebrows um, a few times. Because <laughs> I'm going to try and record some content today. Um, I'm just trying to find the motivation to do it, honestly. Um, it's a little hard to find the motivation. Sorry, I'm like, just like fresh out of the shower. Like my baby just went down for a nap. So we are getting done what we can get done while she's sleeping. But, um, and also, excuse, like, I'm kind of a, looking a mess, but, um, I had, like, gotten a really bad farmer's tan from Easter weekend. Um, I get tan pretty easily. I don't know if any of you, and I don't know, usually not this easily. Um, I don't know if it's, like, pregnancy hormones, like, coming down, you know, but, um, I got really brown, like, like, look at that tan line. That's from my Fitbit. Um, so I, I'm a little neurotic. Um, I can't stand when like, cause I wear tank tops quite a bit and I cannot stand the farmer's tan. I cannot. So I put on some self tanner on like just this part of my arm and like my belly and chest cause I've bought some crop tops I'm trying to be more pos body positive. I am like on a fitness journey. Um, cause I have put on, I had lost like 50 pounds three years ago and then just a lot of life events happened. I had some health issues that cropped up when I was like feeling better than ever. And then I just put all the way back on plus 20 with pregnancy. So <sighs> we're on a fitness journey. I don't want to, I, I call it a weight loss journey too, like on my TikTok, but um, really it's more about being fit. Cause when I had lost that 50 pounds, honestly, I felt amazing. Um, I still was in the 200s. Um, pound wise, but I felt me anyway. I'm getting sidetracked. We're here to talk about Itsy today. Other videos will be coming with more content, so sorry. Anyway, that's why I'm like no bra, like loose clothes, so that my um, sunless tanner can like do its thing and really dry. And um, yeah, let's get into it. So this is for April. Um, my tracking said I wasn't gonna get this till May. Four, but it came today, so I'm pretty excited. Um, I did do some add-ons, so we'll look at that stuff in a minute. And because I'm weird, like I only do the three dollar add-ons with my glam bag, and then I only do the more expensive ones with my glam bag plus. Oh, and if you have seen my glam bag plus video, I got in contact with Ipsy about my missing products. I was missing three products, um, two of my add-ons and one of my regular glam bag products. So they are sending me the Glam Bag product and the Hey Honey Serum, but they were sold out of the QMS Day and Night Cream. So they are supposedly refunding me. I haven't seen it hit my account yet, the refund, but um, that's what's happening there. So they, um, they returned my email pretty quickly. I'd say it was like within two days. I got like, I initially got like, like their automated thing. We're going to look into your claim, that sort of thing within 24 hours. And then within 48 hours, I got an email from a person that said, this is what we're doing to resolve the matter. We are sending out product. Um, and so when I got notification that I had something at the post office, um, cause I also ordered a mystery bag that should be here soon. So I wasn't sure if it was the replacement products cause my glam bag said May 4th or if it was my mystery bag, but it was actually in fact my regular glam bag for April. <laughs> and so the regular glam bag is $12 a month. Um, Honestly, I can't remember if the shipping's free. I think it is. I honestly don't remember. But I leave like the description is, um, of the different boxes. And next month, sorry, I'm all over the place today, you guys. Oh, I'm like trying to get all this stuff done while the baby's asleep and the kids are at school. So I'm like, boop, boop, boop. Um, but next month I'll be getting the Glam Bag X for the first time. So I'm kind of excited. Um, let's get into the Glam Bag. So this month was Force of Nature, which I think... If you saw my other video, you do know that. And for whatever reason, the regular glam bag comes with a description and the plus does not. I don't know why they do that. And sorry guys, <laughs> I have such oily skin that my light is having a hard time. <laughs> it's like, and my camera, between the camera and the light, it's like, what is happening with this face? Okay, sorry. And I just moisturized, so it's also still drying down. Okay, let's get into it. <clears throat> so five products for $12. And honestly, you guys, my bag, I think this month is awesome. Um, I did see it already, so I know what's in here. Um, let's start at the top. Okay. Now, this is a full-size item, you guys. And this is a eyeshadow palette by Pacifica Beauty. And it is infused with hemp. I didn't know that when I saw it on there. 
and it says this retails for ten dollars and um wild hemp eyeshadows and i think that packaging is just adorable with the little tigers on there and i like pacifica beauty i have i received a um bl blush and bronzer duo from pacifica through ipsy and i love it so much it's i've al almost hit pan on it um but here we go it's like Got some, uh, oh, you push the button. That's how we open it. Oh, and I haven't seen one of these little applicators in an eyeshadow forever. But here are the colors. They are so pretty. I'm not gonna swatch these, um, cause I honestly, I might give this to my mom cause she actually likes eyeshadows with these. That's like her biggest complaint whenever I give her eyeshadows. Why doesn't it come with the applicator? I'm like, cause you're supposed to use brushes, mom. <laughs> but she's old school, you know. She does what she knows. So maybe I'll give this to my mom. Um, but this last color is so pretty. You can't really see it on the camera, but it has kind of a violet lilac kind of shimmer to it. It's so pretty. Anyway, she would really probably like this. So I might give it to her, but I don't know. I'm, I kind of want to try the, that it's hemp infused. Maybe I'll just give her the little, <laughs> the little makeup applicator. Okay, guys, uh, next item. I'm gonna try and just go in order of what we've got here. Uh, this is a product by Hey Honey. Um, Ipsy really likes this brand, and I think it is a Korean skincare brand. Um, this is the Hey Honey Boosted Up Honey Rich Moisturizer. This, of course, is a deluxe sample. The full cost of the full size, which is 50 ml, is $51 Ooh, for a moisturizer. I have used several Hey Honey products. I actually really like them, and that's why I got the Hey Honey Eye Serum that I was supposed to get with my glam bag plus as an add-on but um i will definitely be excited to try that i'm actually running low on the current moisturizer i'm using so i'm just going to transition to that instead of opening another full-sized product um my next item is by milk um this is milk makeup kush high volume mascara this is the mini the full size is 24 dollars um i was actually going to try this on with you guys because i didn't put any mascara on and it is hemp infused. Man, this is like, oh, 420, that's probably why. April, that's why they've got so many hemp products. I didn't even think about that. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna actually try this on with you guys. Um, here is what the brush looks like, pretty standard. Um, sorry, I probably look ridiculous trying this on with you guys. I, I have tried last extensions um, like one time. I did them for my birthday when I was pregnant, um, this last November, and I hated them. I loved how they looked, but I did not like the glue. It irritated my eyes so bad, because I'm, I've not ever had them before, and so I didn't really know what to expect, and I rubbed those shits off within a week. <laughs> I could not leave my eyes alone. Um, I don't know that I was necessarily having, like, a reaction, I think it just really like, I don't wear lashes and not used to lashes or anything. Um, and so I just, it really bugged me. So if any of y'all do lash extensions, like have any tips for me, I might try. My friend was telling me about this new, um, these new lashes that you glue on and they're supposed to stay on for like a week. She saw it on TikTok. Um, I love TikTok, you guys, I'm, it's a problem. I just barely got it in February, and honestly, it's like going down the wormhole every time I open it. Um, I like it. It applied nice. Um, I have fairly decent lashes. Um, I do think my children have stolen them from me. With every pregnancy, they get a little bit worse. <laughs> and my children all have beautiful eyelashes, you guys. Everyone always compliments their eyelashes, but I can't think of what the ones that my friend was... <sighs> she just told me, just today, too. Lash... Flutter lashes, is that right? I think that's right. Anyway, and it's a subscription service, I guess, but um, I told her, I'm like, I'm gonna wait and see how you like them <laughs> before I do it. Um, the next product is by Phil Beauty. This is the 4D Hyaluronic Acid Under Eye Cream. Um, I love Ipsy for this. Um, in particular, are the eye creams and serums I'm able to get in sample sizes. Because you guys, this will last forever for just your under eye area. You need hardly any at all, and 
you know, it's going to last a long time. So I love getting eye creams in this bag. So if it's ever an option, I almost always pick them. Um, I don't remember what I picked for this, actually. It might have been this. It was either this or the next product. But um, the full size of this is $45. And also, um, eye products are really expensive. I actually have some open, so I'm not going to open this right now. Um, but this is awesome. It's going to last forever. And the last product in my glam bag for the month of April is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Mini Eye Primer. Full size value is $13. That's about right for an eye primer. Um, sorry, I keep leaning. It's like I have to sit kind of up in this chair. Otherwise, I look like not cute because I'm like all double chinny. <laughs> um, and I might have picked this, honestly, because I knew that this little bit of eye primer would last a long time. As a, even as a sample. So I may have chosen this. I'm not sure. It's between this and the under eye cream. I usually go with like eye products when it's choice items. So anyway, I'm excited. I probably shouldn't have opened that mascara. No, it's okay. I'll use it. I'll just have to wear mascara every day. So anyway, excited to try that. Um, I have, I don't wear eyeshadow a lot, even when I do like full makeup, but um, I have received some new makeup I really want to play in. So I'm excited to get that and try it. Okay, now for my add-ons. I did several add-ons this go-around because there were just things I wanted to try. And I can't remember picking this, but I must have because I got them. Anyway, there's two sheet masks in here. Um, I'm open it. I really don't remember picking this. Um, one is a tea tree pore care and clarifying mask. This looks like it, it's Korean skincare again. And the other is a soothing aloe calming and soothing mask. Um, it says two days mask. I'm not sure what that means. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's like effects are supposed to last for two days. I think maybe that's what it's saying. Because I think they're sheet masks. But maybe, maybe they're sheet masks. Sorry, you guys. I don't mean to, like, be ignoring you. Hmm. Open the pouch, pull out the mask. Okay, yeah, so they are sheet masks. Okay, because I was like, that's weird. Two, day, two days masks. Can you see that? how it says that? I wonder if, like, the effects last for two days. If that's what they're saying. Anyway, I love sheet masks. I love face masks of any kind. So... Maybe that's why I picked it. I don't know. Because I am, like, don't have really any sheet masks right now. So that's possibly why I picked it. I don't know. We'd be crazy. And then I got a Moroccan Magic Lip Balm. Um, it's got argan essential oil in it. So I wanted to try it for $3. So all these add-ons I did were $3. Um, and my husband, whenever he comes to visit from, um, he's living in Colorado and working right now. And so whenever he comes here to visit here in Utah, he always steals my lip balms. So <laughs> I always get, if I see one that looks interesting, I'll get it to try. Because $3 is about what you pay, you know, in the grocery store. Um, the next item I got is by Thrive Cosmetics. And it is a lip liner in shade Devon, which says it's Black Cherry. There. Um... I have another lip liner by Thrive Cosmetics and I really like it a lot. Um, and so I was like, a full lip liner for $3? Yes, please. Ooh, it's pretty, you guys. Look at that. That's pretty. Um, so I'm excited about that. And then I got this for my kids to try. Um, it's by Twisted Sista. It's a 30 second curl spray. Um, my kids all have curly hair. And I am always trying to find new products to help with that. I've been using Cantu products that I just buy at Walmart. Um, and they seem to do okay, but I've done some digging and I've heard that people are saying not to use those products because they actually aren't as moisturizing as they claim to be. So I don't know. Um, and I've heard that this Twisted Sister is a good product, but it's pretty pricey. So I wanted to try it before I spent the money on it. Um, so yeah, that's why I got that to try with my kids, particularly my daughter. It's so hard because um, my kids are biracial and their hair texture is like mine, but it's really curly like their dad's. So their hair is very dry. And I think curls in general, dry 
easier, like my hair is really straight. I mean, it's kind of wavy because I had it in a bun, but my hair is really straight. So I, <laughs> I don't have experience with curly hair. And I know that moisture is like the key for curly hair. So they don't really have the texture of um, some of those more dense curly hair. Um, it's not as coarse as some of that curly hair like um, that like my husband has. Like his hair's a little bit coarser and tighter curls, but um, they all have kind of curly hair, but like my hair texture. Like my hair is very fine. Um, it can get very dry. And so they have like double whammy. They've got curlies which is drier and they got my fine hair, which can be dry and also oily. I don't know, it's the weirdest thing. Anyway, that's why I got that. <laughs> I don't know why I feel like I need to like explain my whole life in one video, but here we go. And this last item I wanted to try, it's by Male Beauty Clearly Brilliant Tinted Lips and this is in shade Fuchsia. Cause I'm more of a like lip gloss, um, tinted lip oil kind of gal. Um, I do love a nice lipstick, and that's why I like Jeffree Star's lipsticks, especially his liquid lips, because I've tried a lot of liquid lip, and I do not like them. But his don't feel, like, heavy on my lips, and they don't dry my lips out as much, so I do appreciate that. That's why I like his lips. Like, I don't care what the man does in his personal life, because his lipstick's fantastic. Like, it's not my business, and um, it's just about the makeup for me. That's pretty, right? I kind of like that. That's a good, like, everyday, on the go, and it feels really nice. Um, now, this is not going, this is like a reapply multiple times a day, I'm sure, but I like it. What do you guys think? Don't mind, I'm having some breakout issues, too. I'm telling you, the postpartum hormones are crashing. It's, it's a mess. You should see my shower. <laughs> with my hair every day. I brush the shit out of my hair, sorry. Excuse me for the language. Anyway, every day, like before I get in the shower, like this way, underneath, every direction, and I still like just handfuls of hair coming down. And I know it's the, I know it's to be expected after you have a baby, they just rob you of everything. <laughs> um, but they're worth it, I love them. So anyway, that was my April glam bag, the regular glam bag, um, and my add-ons. Um, I know I probably shouldn't spend the money on the add-ons, but honestly, like, they're cheaper than they are normally, and if I can grab a good deal for a product I might end up loving, I'm gonna do it. Um, <clears throat> I'm overall very satisfied, and for $12, you go, <laughs> you goes. Um, I'm trying not to say guys. I keep doing that, it's such a habit, and I'm trying so hard to break saying guys. I don't know, does that like offend? Is that one of those things that we should not do? I'm, and I don't mean to be super ignorant about it, I just, I feel like it is something that I shouldn't say, but it's so ingrained in my core being. I'm trying, that, trying everybody. <laughs> um, but for the $12, I got a full-size eyeshadow palette, I got a mascara sample, yes. I got an eye, serum, uh, eye cream, which is a sample, but will last me about what I would say a full-size product is worth. Um, an eye primer, and what was my other thing? Mascara, oh, the moisturizer. So I think this bag was awesome this month. I love Ipsy so much. I love it so much more than Boxy. Um, I am going to give Boxy one more month, mostly because the pop-up is next month, I believe on the 19th. Um, and the pop-up is always fantastic. I haven't bought anything for the add-ons. Um, I think either yesterday or today was the last day, and I wanted to check it out one more time because I started doing some BOGOs um, and combining some products for really cheap, so I wanted to check it out, but I may have missed it. Um, so anyway, um, we'll do at least one more month of Boxy. I'll show you guys what I get. Uh, like I said, I don't want my channel to only be unboxings. That's so far what it is, but that's not what I anticipated or planned when I started my channel. Um, it's just what I end up having time to record for you guys. But um, yeah, let me know what you guys thought in the comments. Um, I've also been doing lots of self-care things. Well, we'll talk about that in another video. Let's get some different content. I'm going to do some more videos and show you some other things that I've purchased that I love. I have a bunch of empties I've saved to talk about. So um, hopefully you'll be seeing me soon with some more videos. 
See you all later.